Guys, it's the Minecraft Pick Pro, back to you with another video playing with my friend. Now this video, we are in the nether playing on this server. And I, um, TPA to my friend, Shadow. Then I do slush team home, which is which teleports me to our base. I have full iron armor with a diamond sword and an iron pickaxe. I put some stuff in the chest after closing the chest and checking my inventory. After checking my inventory, I grab some cobwebs. Um, noticing that was there was water everywhere. After that, I see my friend Shadow. And he hands me a pickaxe because he wants to mine some, um, he wants to mine some obby, aka obsidian. So I put the pickaxe in my iron pickaxe slot and we start mining. Later he tells me about this, um, hidden ender chest. That he put somewhere. Um, so yeah, I mined the obsidian, and he mined it too to speed up the thing. Then I give him the two obby, and then I go. I give him I back the pickaxe, and I try to TPA, but I can't for another four minutes and forty-four seconds. I check in the chest for something, talking to my friend about something, then closing the chest. Opening the chest to see what Shadow is putting in there, breaking the ground for no reason, and getting some saplings just to see if they they you're able to sell them. I type in chat slash sell here, no item found to sell, so so sub things cannot be sell, sold. He shows me the end chest, and I accidentally have some torches in my left hand, so I put those down. He had to back up, and he tells me it's just for if anyone tries to grief the base. I see how much torches I have. Putting them in another place. And seeing and getting some more blocks so I can patch the thing up because he didn't shadow didn't patch it that much. Patching all the obby thing up in the ground, then going over to make some buttons and putting it on the block where the things, where the end chest is behind, and saying to Shadow that I just made the best item in Minecraft as a joke. Then I put them in other parts of the corridor, so if anyone tries to grip the base, they won't think it's suspicious. I put it in random spots with two more to go and putting them nearly everywhere. After doing that, I have my cobweb and walk over to Shadow and he RTPs. So I see if I can RTP but I can't for another 2 minutes and 23 seconds and I go crazy because I really want to RTP. Or I can get some cactus to sell it to get money. I get my shears. Get my shears. Closing the chest. Trying to RTP, but I can't for another two minutes and five seconds. So see if the seconds have gone down, but it went down four. So I RTP one more time to shadow. After RTPing, I asked if he, I asked if he can um, let me and I've been teleported to some random spot. He swims away. And 
and I run the other direction. <laughs> Climbing up the mountain as it is night time to try and find sugar cane because that sells my the money you get from me is about like two thousand dollars or something. I don't know the logics of that, but whatever. I'm going down the mountain. And running to some sugar cane that I found. Not knowing that Shadow was actually following me to get, following me to get the exact sugar cane that I was heading for. <laughs> Time to catch up to him, breaking it and getting three sugar cane. Then him asking if he can um give me give if he can give some of the money so he can buy a spawner. I sell the sugar cane for two two hundred and three sugar cane equals two hundred and forty. Making and randomly making some and then I randomly made some weird ritual thing. With fire and torches around it. After that, breaking up because it was no use. <sighs> Accidentally typing something in chat and hanging for this cave so no one can find me to give Shadow the money so he can buy a spawner. Accidentally writing TPR. Which is the wrong one for RTP. I have $2,668. Then he tells me to... Shadow tells me to type something in chat. And I get it wrong, but then I get it. I try to look for the heart that he's trying to sell. Not knowing that he's the first one at the very top. Going through different pages. Trying and trying to find it. <laughs> and not finding it. After not finding it, I go to the next page. To check if it's there. I see if that is the heart bit red dye because in other servers they used to be what hearts look like. I go to the next page, but that's from another player. I ask him where it is, and he says it's on the first page. So I go all the way back, and he says it's the top one. So I buy it, and now I only have six hundred and sixty-eight dollars left. But hopefully, I get more money soon. After standing still and running away to find more sugar cane. But what I didn't know is that I was going to find some pumpkins. And then that would save me a lot and a lot of money. Which means I could get about $15. For each. Or 200 I'm not pretty sure. Checking something, running to find some pumpkins or sugar cane or anything. I asked Shadow how much sugar cane is and how much pumpkins are. Now there are like about six or five zombies. Towering up with a creeper trying to get me and billions of zombies. Trying to shoot the creeper getting take aim in this server. Mining the tower down because I knew I had to hit them because I 
I only had about four or three bows left. Not that much. Hitting one of the zombies, realizing I was too high up. And the creeper exploding, which only leaves two zombies alive. Then towering up because I was only on two hearts and trying to kill them. Hoping that I wouldn't die and it was good that I placed that other block so now I could reach them. Killing both zombies and asking Shadow how much the pumpkins were for money. So I could. So I started mining all the pumpkins. <laughs> and that's gonna do it for today's video.